Holy shit on the left. Oh, that's way too many. Need some healing. Oh, yeah. Nice. Hi guys, this is Matty Ace, and this is going to be an AIM tutorial, uh, my first one in Battlefield 1, and because for a lot of you this is going to be my very first AIM tutorial, I'm going to keep this rather basic. However, I used to make these on a more regular basis, and all in all, this is probably somewhere around the 15th or 20th of these types of guides. Now when it comes to aim, this is something that can be put in a lot of different categories. And what I want to focus on in this particular video is the reactionary aim in hectical situations where you have a lot of different targets and we have to really, really quickly adjust from one target to another. Normally, this happens in close quarter combat situations. No! Now the different ways that you can improve this are many, and here are a few suggestions of mine. First and foremost, I would say, just like with my flying tutorials, go to an empty server and make sure that you have the settings that works for you. Now this can take a lot of time actually, but the first thing that I would suggest you to do is to find a few fixed targets and try to switch between them as fluently as possible. Now there are two things that I would like you to focus on at first. One is precision, or as another way of saying it would be, trying to be pixel perfect. While the other thing that you should be focusing on is speed. In actual combat, you're not going to have much time to adjust your aim. And what you're trying to do here is to build up muscle memory, so that whenever an enemy shows up on your screen, you can just act on reflexes. Now it doesn't matter much what uh, parts of the environment you choose as your targets, but keep mixing it up. Remember to switch between targets that are at different distances from each other's, and also keep switching between more than two targets. Now one of the most important settings in this situation is your sensitivity, whether it's a mouse or a controller. And if you find that when you're switching from one target to another, your crosshair is moving past the target, and then you have to readjust by moving it back again, then what that probably means is that your sensitivity is too high. And that is the most common problem among PC players that haven't done this before. Now if you, on the other hand, when you're trying to quickly put your aim on target, have to move your crosshair even more in the same direction because your initial reactionary aim wasn't enough, then that is probably an indication that you have to have a little bit higher sensitivity in order to perfect your aim. Now the possibilities when it comes to finding exercises to improve your aim like this are basically endless. Now a really good way of finding out uh, your sensitivity is to make a 180 degree turnaround. And especially for low sense players, you want to make sure that you in one move can just quickly turn around and quickly put your aim on something that is directly behind you. I'm sure that goes without saying that the differences here with what you need to think about are quite big depending on whether or not you're doing this with mouse and keyboard or if you're doing this with a console controller. But regardless of your platform, it's really important that you have the settings that works for you. And once you feel that you're getting the hang of this, what you want to do is add movement into your exercises. Because as much as you want to be able to hit your enemies, you want to make sure that you make it as hard as possible for them to hit you. So now once you've figured out what sensitivity you want and you feel that you're happy about it, you really want to know what it is. Now the way I do this is that I find a fixed target, in this case a tree, and then I make a 360 degree turnaround until the reticle is at the exact same place again, and then I measure the distance that I needed to move my hand in order to complete this full circle. Now for me, this is 38 centimeters. Now unfortunately the sensitivity settings in Battlefield is extremely bad, so in order for me to have the settings the way I want it, I had to lower my CPI on my mouse from 800 to 400, because with 800 DPI, I would either get somewhere around 35 centimeters with it set on 6, or 40 centimeters with it set on 5. And because Battlefield is Battlefield, there is nothing in between. Now some of you guys, especially the ones of you who are relatively new to this, might react to my settings as something that is very, very low. But if you look in the professional Counter-Strike scene, for example, you'll see that there are plenty of top players that have a far lower sensitivity than I have, and 400 DPI is nothing uncommon at all. You'll find the link to this chart in the description below. 
And normally with these types of videos, I also put a lot of focus on the weapons handling, such as burst fire and recoil control, but in Battlefield 1, that is not particularly important. Sometimes, however, you do benefit from it, even in this game. So now I also want to quickly mention a few other categories of aim that I might focus on in a future video. This was a tiny bit of leading, meaning that I was aiming ahead of the target in order for the bullet to connect. Another common category is called tracking, meaning that you maintain your aim on a moving target when it requires uh, around a second or more in order to kill it. Sometimes you actually have to both lead and track at the same time. Now obviously leading and tracking are related to longer distances. Oh, get fucking wrecked. Fuck, whole fucking medic army on B. <laughs> get fucking wrecked. You kill him? Yeah, yeah. Probably. Yeah, I killed another guy. So now, depending on the feedback from this video, I might cover the other categories of aim as well. But for now, we'll keep it at one thing at a time. Now, remember one of the things that I mentioned earlier. Movement is a very important part of this. And the way you move and how much you move is going to impact your aim significantly. So now, if you just want to stats pad and you want to take screenshots of your in-game accuracy, you don't want to move around the way I do here. I move a lot and I shoot in situations before I have my aim perfectly on the target. This is about speed. It's about landing your first shot as soon as possible, and it's about making sure that your target is actually dead before you stop shooting. Now, whether or not you care about in-game oh. stats or not, that is of course entirely up to you. Bomb killed. We have One of so yeah, yeah, I hope this video was helpful, that you will improve, and that you will reach your in-game goals. Good luck, have fun. My name is Matthias, and I want to thank you all for watching. <laughs> How fucking crazy was that? Careful, we have the fortress gun. No, you love it. Yeah. <laughs> Love it. Ho lanciato una granata, via! Oh, bien! Questa granata è tutta per me! Once again, please call. Just playing the guys in the attack. Oh, what? <clears throat> Uh, Take a med kit for Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, they're, they're, they're going for uh, D. They're going for D. Yeah, There's somebody here. Go. There's somebody here. We could go clear it out later, maybe. Because they're probably gonna camp. On me. There's the guy. Two guys. Yeah. I thought they were pruning there. Archie truck. Oh, I killed him! <laughs> yeah, I'm coming for you, yes. Nice. Uh, on your left, I marked it. Once more. Oh. Tank hunter is the dead. Zeppelin. Yeah, they're in on D. I'm behind you. 
I think I should lower my graphic settings because I'm getting like 80, 70, 80 frames here. Fuck, oh, can you revive me? They're yeah, hurt. yeah, yeah. They're hurt as fuck. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, that grenade spam. Oh, we uh, got that tank. Here, sniper is behind you. All right. On that bridge, he's camping. Yeah. 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 Oh, he's dead. Nice. Okay, let's go for C. Mhm. Mm sure. Oh, they're up on that on that si side. Oh shit! There's a sniper. On the. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, let's go through the houses. Ooh. Ooh, fuck. No. Nice. Oh shit. <laughs> you hear me? Close. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Pull the guy outside. Ooh. I got sniped again from that tea house. Oh fuck! Oh shit! <laughs> Fucking Four. everything shot me there. Three, six guys in there. Six guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, fuck! I was a little bit of a hell regal clean up there. Ah, oh, shit! Yeah. <laughs> 